Pretty women. Fascinating. Sipping coffee. Dancing pretty women. It's the first time for Sweeney for me, uh-huh. My sort of propensity for that thing is, is, is much of a secret. Anybody who knows my career and knows where I come from, uh, they're going to know that that's part of what I do. When I looked at the story and I, you, know, you see that he has his life upended by these powerful men who decide that they, as the governors of the world, get to live by one set of laws and that the governed should live by another set of laws. And it's an unequal application of justice. And, he gets yanked out of his world in, in order so that the judge can take his, take his wife away from him. Because no one, you know, as low as Sweeney, should be allowed to have someone as wonderful as Lucy. And so he's shipped off to Australia into a, into a prison. Now, I've done a lot of characters about with, with, with these kind of issues. I've done uh, Joseph de Roche and Dead Man Walking, which I'll be doing next year here. He's a death row inmate. Uh, Colonel Floyd James Thompson, who, was, who spent nine years in a prison camp in Vietnam. So it's a similar situation. He was sent off to prison and lost everything. Had to come back to a world that had moved on without him. So these characters, you know, I, I play a lot of guys like that, you know. And so you, you sort of, you see these, these rhythms and these patterns that start to emerge, especially when you do this kind of repertoire. What became sort of my signature repertoire is 21st century opera in English, you know. Stories about real people and stories that I, what I like to call opera with a conscience, you know. Uh, contemporary Amer American Verismo opera. These things, this is what I really connected with in the repertoire. I, I don't know a lot of other singers that do as much of that as I do. There's people that do, but it's just not as common, but I think it's becoming more common now. You know, one of the benefits of, of doing this for a living is that, you know, people I found in, in this business, uh, the rule is people are really kind and really welcoming and really, you know, that we're all out here just trying to survive. We're all out here spending time away from our families. And so everyone is really, you know, eager to help each other, you know, so that's what's great about it.